Health experts have long known that there's a strong connection between our physical and mental health. Wellspan's now doing more to integrate the treatment of both. Eight on your side investigative reporter Susan Shapiro has more on how it's benefiting patients. Matt Jackson plays bass guitar in a band. But the 33 year old's life has hit some low notes over the years. He went to the emergency room at York Hospital almost 100 times in 2012 because of heart problems that have affected his physical and mental health. It's very trying. Um, it, it's, it's, it's very, very, very trying because uh, every day I don't know what it's going to bring. So he started seeing the director of behavioral health at Wellspan. One of the really specific things we worked on from a behavioral health side was his level of anxiety about things. His physical health created a great deal of anxiety. Wellspan is now combining behavioral health with traditional patient care, given the strong connection between physical and mental health. Now, of course, this is a very long term process. Behaviorists like Sophia Chernoff are in the hospital owned family practices. She's able to talk with patients while they're here for a medical appointment. Really addressing some of those pieces, those psychosocial concerns, um, can improve their physical well being and their medical status. Wellspan has been able to make this work here because the behaviorists are all interns. They've had a lot of training, but they're still paid a lot less than a staff person would be. This gives the primary care doc the added help they need in their team to do it. Mac can no longer work as a computer engineer. But through his counseling, he has learned coping techniques that have improved his quality of life and dramatically reduced his emergency department visits. It's like night and day. It, it really is. Um, and I, I'm just really proud to, to be a part of it, um, you know, because it helped me. Susan Shapiro on your side, News 8. Wellspan's looking into a possible affiliation with Phil Haven, a behavioral health care provider in the Susquehanna Valley.